Hey everyone, the famous mommy here. So I'm laying here and I'm feeding my baby right now and I wanted to share something with you that's really important um, because she's fallen asleep at the breast. Um, but the way that she fell asleep, I wanna show you that you need to be careful because if this is how your baby, um, people like to co-sleep with their babies, but if this is how your baby fell asleep, you have to be careful because they can suffocate. So I'm gonna show you right now like how she's sleeping. Do you see how she kind of fell asleep? She fell asleep on the breast. Okay, but right here, I, I have to open this area because what right now, like if I left her there, you can see how she fell asleep, she can suffocate. So you always wanna make sure that your breast is not covering their nostrils and that you make sure that you open up the airway for them to be able to breathe. That's why it's very dangerous for you to uh, let the baby fall asleep at the breast and fall asleep yourself. So I do suggest that you don't fall asleep yourself with your baby on the breast. You can easily like re-maneuver, like if I move down this way, I have now re-maneuvered my breast to where it opens up her, her air line and that way she can breathe. So if you can see right here, see how her nose is open now? It's open from the air. It's like it's not pressing on. The way it was was like this. That can suffocate the baby and that is very dangerous. So I just wanted to share that with you real quick because I think that it's very important to you know know these things because sometimes a new breastfeeding mom may not understand or may not know this. And you know, it's very easy with the oxytocin and all the prolactin and everything going on in your body, all the hormones that relax you when you're feeding your baby, when you're breastfeeding your baby, that it can calm you and make you sleepy. So please mommies and families out there, beware very careful that you know, you're in a right position in order to breastfeed your baby properly. That way, you know, the no see how her nose is now open. The airway is open, she's good to go, and um, but you still shouldn't fall asleep next to your baby this way at all. You know, um, I know people do, but it's very easy. You can put your thumb right here and unattach the baby from the breast, and then you know you can put them in their crib and have them safely sleep. You have to really be careful with um, SIDS because it's an, at least until a year old, um, you know, it's a very, very sad, very scary thing. So definitely do your research about that. I'm here, the Famous Mommy is here to spread awareness and to educate you guys on all these great, wonderful things about breastfeeding and also all the dangers and things about co-sleeping and breastfeeding, falling asleep at the breast, things of that nature. Falling asleep at the breast and letting your baby stay on the breast for too long while she's asleep or he's asleep can also cause tooth decay. So it's definitely a good thing to unattach the baby from the breast or wake them up while they're breastfeeding feeding so that they get plenty of nourishment from your breast milk. I hope that you guys learned something today from this educational video. This is for educational purposes only. I thank you so much for watching The Famous Mommy. Please take a minute to subscribe to our channel down below and like our videos and we'll see you guys in the next one. Make sure you hit that little bell so you don't miss an episode.